Welcome back to Tendile Gaming Legends and Heroes. This is a special video here today because I've got some things I really want to talk about with all of you. At this point in time, we're currently going through something we've never gone through. I've talked about this several times throughout many uh, of our Boundless videos here on the channel that have been pretty well received and I appreciate that support, so thank you. But we're in unprecedented times, or at least that's what everybody keeps telling us. How long are they unprecedented if they continue, though? And how do we deal with all of that? Me, I don't always feel like I've been dealing with it in the best way. I've gotten angry. I've made mistakes. What do we do with all of that all these things well we don't leave them undone we don't leave them be we have to fix it if we can and the best thing I can do is enjoy the time that we have together me and my family have been going completely crazy staying home but we need to stay home because we're a family and we're stronger together especially when we're healthy I love my family and I know they love me even though I'm weird they accept that they accept all my flaws and I accept theirs it's funny we get kind of caught up in the rat race if you will normally we'd be doing all kinds of stuff running around picking up all kinds of things doing all kinds of other things play dates trying to schedule stuff with friends trying to maybe st I don't know have a barbecue coming up getting ready for Mother's Day preparing for my wife's birthday up here in a, in a couple of weeks and instead we're at home safe waiting for this to end and I feel like that's important that we say we're waiting patiently waiting we're in no hurry for this lockdown to end for this pandemic to end too soon it really feels like people are not using their common sense with this global health crisis today my wife and my son and I went on a drive now it's not recommended that you travel and we didn't travel very far maybe 10 miles and we didn't get out of the car just to kind of experience the world again and what we saw were other people experiencing the world in the middle of a pandemic and that was really frightening to see people not really taking care for themselves and care for others because that's the point here if you have complete disregard for yourself I don't really know what to say about that I, other than I don't like that you should care for yourself it says a lot about who you are about how you care about yourself but when you're putting yourself at risk during these unprecedented times, you're putting others at risk too. People like me and my family, when we maybe go out on a walk, or my wife when she travels to the grocery store, the every two weeks that she's been able to do it, and she's done amazing, amazing, keeping us going. I feel like she is the heart of this family, whether she knows it or not. I think she does know. I tell her often, so I guess she does. But we've got to be careful. If you can stay home, stay home. If you can't stay home, stay home. If you're not essential, man, 
What's the point in putting yourself at risk and putting others at risk? This is not the kind of risk you want to do. You don't want to take it. Why would you want to do this to yourself and to others? Right now, it's a time of togetherness. We should be standing together and staying home. It's so simple. It's so very simple. And right now, I feel so grateful, so thankful. And I'm doing my best to be good to each other, even though it's not been easy. I hear you guys out there. I hear you. It's not easy. It hasn't been easy for me. I've lost my temper. I've said things I maybe didn't mean. But you cool off. You apologize. And you embrace the kindness and love in all of us. And that's the point. By staying home, you could be saving someone's life. And my family and I, even though we're driving ourselves crazy every once in a while, I feel like we're saving each other's lives every single day. And isn't that something to be thankful for? To be grateful for? I think so. Do your part. Stay home. And stay safe. Thanks for watching this video. I appreciate the support. I really, really do. I hope to see you again soon. Stay awesome and stay safe.